All right, today I'm going to explain how to create detailed characters for story writing. So I have three different story writing planning pages here that are all based around characters. So the first type of character that I'm going to create is my main character. And the main character is the character that is the star of the story. So the story will mostly be about that character. I'm also going to create a villain. So who makes problems for my main character in the story? And then my main character is going to have a side character who helps your main character in the story. Today I'm going to just flesh out my main character for you so that you can see what types of details you should include when you are writing your own main character. So I'm going to start with my main character's name. And for my main character, I have chosen the name Hal Apino. Okay, next we're going to look at where does my character live. And I'm going to have my character live in a fictional place, so I'm going to make up a place, and I'm going to call this place Godsonville. Your setting could be a real place if you wanted to, but it can also be made up. <clears throat> Okay, next, what does your main character like to do? All right, so I've thought about a few things that my main character likes to do. My main character likes to cook. My main character likes to play video games. And the person that he likes to play video games with is his best friend, my side character. And he likes to spend time with his friend, Alligator. All right, now I'm going to look at what are three interesting facts about my main character? So I said that my main character likes to cook and I said that because my main character is a chef. And my main character is a chef who specializes in cooking spicy food. And the restaurant where he creates this spicy food is a restaurant called Hot Tamales. And something else that's interesting about my character Hal Apino is that he yells when he talks. Okay, so those are all my details about my main character. You can tell some of them are connected and some of them are a little bit separate um, and they're kind of quirky and interesting because I have to spend a whole story talking about this character. So I don't wanna just write things like jalapeno is nice. Just about every single person on planet earth is nice. Okay, the last part um, is going to be, what does your main character look like? You can draw a picture or you can describe the character using detailed sentences. Um, one thing that I know for sure that I want about Hal Apino's looks is that he's going to have red hair. And I'm gonna draw a picture of Hal Apino a little bit later and I can show that to you later. Um, but the main details that you really wanna focus on are what does your main character like to do? And three interesting facts about your main character. And now that I'm finished my main character, I'm gonna move on to um, creating my side character and my villain character. 
Now that I've finished creating my main character, I know the characteristics that Jalapeno is going to have, and I want to make sure that my side character and my villain character are very distinct from Jalapeno. So I'm going to make sure they have their own different and unique characteristics so that I can tell my three characters apart. All right, so I have finished filling out my three character sheets all of the details as well as my little drawing. So this is my finished side character, Al E. Gator. And here is my finished villain, Robin Banks. And of course, our main character, Hal Apino.